Good evening. Welcome to the latest Saturday Night Show with William Duan. This is my 11th episode and I really hope you guys enjoy it. And this is also my last offline episode because the next week will be the live show, which will be my last show. It's quite been a long journey and I really enjoy it. I hope you guys will show up in the live show and support me. Your appearance means a lot to me and really motivates me during the past three or four months. Thank you very much. And now, let's have a look at what's going on on the show today. Now is usual a time for a conversation with a special guest. Today, I invited the show not only one special guest, but two special guests. Um, and they are two trouble mixer, but luckily, they all graduate this year, and so do I. And if they are separated, one of them will be pretty salty, and the, the other one, not so much. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome two troublemakers, Lily and Aspen. Welcome Lily and Aspen. How are you today? I'm good. I'm good Have a seat. Well. Awesome. And now, um, first, first question, would you like anything to drink? Um, no, I'm really not thirsty at this time. Would you like something to eat? Oh, oh yes, please. No, that's fine. We brought ice cream for ourselves, actually. Interesting. Yeah. Okay. So the first question I have for both of you and uh, is... trash. Uh, trash. Yeah, thanks. Um, <laughs> is, uh, I'm actually very curious about this question. So how did you guys meet each other? Because I wish it didn't happen, so I would be very peaceful right now. Um... When I was nine and Lily was ten, we both were riding at the same um, horseback riding barn, um, and that's basically how we met. We just met riding horses together, and yeah. Lily was actually really nice to me, at least when she yeah. was ten. Maybe not to other people. Yeah, I I had been riding at the barn, and Aspen was a 4-H member, and she would come and we'd have lessons together, and I would be really nice to the 4-H kids because they're not very good at riding. Hmm. That's all right. I'm not really good at riding either. Um, I we haven't saw, ridden We before. saw. That was really embarrassing, actually. <laughs> really much. All right. So what is your favorite memories with each other? Well, let me take ice cream first. Um, my favorite memory with Lily was when we were um, young. We had, like, barely known each other. Um, we were in Lily's car, and her mom was like, Aspen, what do you want to be when you grow up? And I was like, oh, I want to be a veterinarian. And then she asked Lily, Lily, what do you want to be when you grow up? And Lily said, homeless in New York City. It's, it's my dream. I um, wish your dream come true. Yeah, thank you. Um, uh, my favorite memory with Aspen, though, is we went to Philadelphia this past year. And we got to go on college tours together. Mm. And it was really fun because we went down with just my mom and my sister. And it was really fun. Oh, that's amazing. So that's great memories with each other. Yeah. All right, so now this question is for Lily only. So if you can use three words to describe Aspen, what are they? Um, I would say that Aspen is caring. She is um, passionate about school and she's a Mormon. What do you think about that? Um, yeah, it's pretty accurate. Hmm. It's quite interesting when people on air still behave, behave differently from people in real life. Um, oh, always that nice. Okay, so what about Aspen? This question is for you. Mm -hmm. From 1 to 10, how mean is Lily? Um, to me, Lily is about a 3 on the mean scale, but um, in our calculus class, Lily Lily gets up to a 7, sometimes a little higher if the occasion calls for it. Oh yeah, you guys are both in calculus, so you know mm -hmm. what is the rate uh, of increase over the year. So what is the rate of uh, increase for Lily's meanness over the year? Mm. I feel like that was pretty mean in the beginning. Mm. I feel like it hasn't changed. It's it hasn't almost changed. been steady then. Mm. Well, one week she was really, really mean, mm. but then the rest of the time she's been pretty steady growth. Oh. Pretty steady growth of your name. <laughs> oh my god. I haven't talked to so many people that when they say they are mean, they still happy and smile <laughs> about that. That's really surprised me. So let's talk a little bit about some nicer topics. Um, Aspen. So it is close to the end of the four years of the, you are the senior this year. Mm -hmm. So it means your four years of high school is about to end and you will go to college yep. and you too. Mm -hmm. So Maybe. Well, what, we hope. Yeah. <laughs> what is something that you are proud of the most in high school? 
Um, I'm proud that I tried a whole bunch of new things, like managing softball and new clubs and um, new classes, and I stuck through them even if I didn't necessarily enjoy all of them. Um, and it's been a good experience. Awesome. Yeah, great experience. And what about you, Lily? Is bullying me one of the things you're proud of the most in high school? Um, for sure, yeah. Um, well, you see, I didn't have all four years to do that, which was a disappointment. But um, I'd say that the most um, impressive thing that I've done in all four years is my dedication to the Special Olympics program mm. at the school. Um, it was really growing and thriving my freshman year, but then all the seniors left. And since then, I have got Aspen to join, and we've brought the program back, so it's really great. Yeah. I'm really happy to hear the answer because besides the time you're being mean, you are nice to organize mm -hmm. uh, the Special Olympics, mm -hmm. which again, very interesting. And um, what are you guys majoring in college? Um, I'll be majoring in biology with a concentration in animal science mm. um, and business administration. Mm. I'll I'm be sure. um, majoring <laughs> in engineering. Um, which is undeclared at most colleges right now, but I hope to go into structural engineering. Oh, that's awesome. So what is your plan for the summer? I plan to work. I have a couple of things that are potentially going to line up, but I am definitely going to be babysitting um, the boy that I babysit every summer who has Down syndrome. Poor kid. <laughs> Um, what about you, Aspen? Um, I'll be working at Granite Hall store in Round Pond. Oh, is that an ice cream store? It is an ice cream store, as well as a candy store. Oh. Um, it's really fun. It's and very easy to gain weight. Yeah. yeah, that's true. But we eat enough ice cream anyway, so it's yeah. okay. Yeah, okay. Um, and I'll be visiting family members in Utah and Texas. Oh, poor family. Yeah. Okay. Um, poor family. It, Aspen's a nice one. Oh. My bad. Um, <laughs> it actually reminds me of last summer when we all worked together in the in the summer camp at Lincoln Academy for middle school from China's coming here. Yeah, mm -hmm. It was such a crazy time. And you remember when I went to the Taylor Swift concert uh, in Massachusetts? we do. She's, you left us short She's gorgeous. Do you agree? No. 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 She's you're, she's you're, you're the only one that thinks that. Yeah. Oh, you guys are so funny. So who's your favorite singer then? Um, my favorite singer is Mac Miller, even though he's dead. His song 2009 is amazing. Mm -hmm. mm, that's such a literally deep moment. What about you? <laughs> um, I don't really have a favorite singer. I like a whole bunch of different types of music and artists. And, mm. What yeah. about your celebrity crush? Mm, there's not one. <sighs> she didn't not even you. She didn't watch a lot of my show, I guess. Uh, okay, so Lily and Aspen, you guys are taking college level math right now. So it's really impressive in my opinion. And can you answer a um, simple math question for me? Yeah. Awesome. So I <laughs> no ask, way. how many seconds are there in a year? No calculator. Just make a good guess. Too many seconds. Yeah, you want me to say the answer? Yeah, right? say the answer. Um, the answer is twelve seconds, because we have January second, February second, March second, April second to mm -hmm. uh, that's wrong. December wrong. second. No, that's wrong. <laughs> no. <laughs> All right. Okay, I will do uh, some calculation now then. So can you take uh, one of your phone out, please, mm -hmm. and go in the calculator part? How are you guys enjoying your ice cream? It's really it's good. It's so good. Yours might be melting. Yeah, that's yours, but we just didn't tell you. Yeah, we actually brought you ice cream. I'm not wrong when this kid a bullier. Well. So now, pick your uh, a random five-digit number. All right. And now, plus it with a random four-digit number. But remember that number. And what is the answer? Um, sixty-two thousand. Six hundred and ninety. Wait, say it again. Sixty-two thousand six hundred and ninety. Okay, can I have a look at it? Uh -huh. Oh, wow. So, let me guess the four-digit number. Uh -huh. Um, count from one to ten. All right. One, two, three, four, five, six. Stop. The first digit is a five. Yep. Okay. So can I, let me count the second digit number. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. It's a nine. Mm -hmm. Your eyes. 
the next number. Uh, can you count? Um, From zero to okay, to, okay. To um, zero Stop. one. Stop. <laughs> it's a zero. And the last digit, can you count? Zero one. Stop. It's a one. Is that five nine zero one? Yes, it is. Jasmine's birthday. Oh, yeah. happy birthday! No. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just kidding. May 9th, 2001. <laughs> <laughs> your fingers. I haven't seen any special guests <laughs> losing their mind that much in the show like this. Ugh. But anyway, uh, now I will have a challenge for you. Are you up for it? Mm -hmm. Awesome. And the challenge name is how much do Aspen and Lily know each other? First, I will give Aspen a word or a phrase and you cannot speak but only act using your body language to make Lily guess the word. After right. Aspen turn, it will be Lily's turn. And each of you guys only have 30 seconds to act. Are you, is that clear for you guys? Mm -hmm. Awesome, let's do it. And the first person to act is Aspen. Oh, no. So this is your word. You have 30 seconds, start from now. All right. See, you see. You should use some like vision. What? No, so, something so... vision. No, I'm not using the visual. <laughs> <laughs> you see, have you something long? Um, okay, well, that doesn't help at all. <laughs> Columbia! No, see you, Em. No, that's wrong. Wait. See? Cucumber. Exactly, it's cucumber. That's such a weird one. What the heck? <laughs> I thought the words were gonna be cool. Okay, <laughs> the next one is for Lily. So uh, I, okay. Lily, are you ready? Mm -hmm. Here's the word. Mm. 30 seconds, start from now. Mm -hmm. <laughs> How do I just this? Yes! <laughs> <laughs> it's correct. And now, it's your turn. Oh no. 30 seconds, start from now. Taylor Swift, William, in love. <laughs> <laughs> Taylor Swift, <laughs> Vietnam. <laughs> I love the, your idea, Taylor Swift, Vietnam. I like it. <laughs> what about Taylor Swift? William, ha hair? <laughs> Great. <laughs> I give you extra time. I like this one. Eyes, eyebrows. <laughs> huh? Snake. Smart. Fake. Taylor Swift. How is she? Beautiful. Exactly. No. <laughs> <laughs> you guys are so mean. That's just wrong. You're wrong about that. Uh, She's. <laughs> she doesn't have. A <laughs> she doesn't her hair. Her legs look. Last word is for Lily. Okay. It is. Uh, why are you doing that word? Okay. <laughs> you have thirty seconds. Start from now. It's like. Bird. Lily. House. <laughs> Lily's house. So close, so close, so close. A boy chicken, mm. which is called a rooster. Yeah. Exactly, it's a rooster. All right, it's also the end of the challenge, and you guys did a pretty good job. You like it? Yeah, it was I fun. Mm, it was fun. Okay, awesome. And that uh, challenge also wrap up the conversation between you guys and me today. Thank you very much for being in the show today, and thank you very much for the ice cream. Also, I didn't know it was for me, so I don't know how you guys think, but. Look at the carry. We miss you guys a lot when you guys graduate and good luck in college. Thank you thank very much you, for being here. Thank you. Thank, thank you. you. And the conversation between Lily and Aspen also wrap up the 11th episode, which is the last offline episode that I have. I hope you guys really enjoy it. And please show up at the Pole Theater at 7 p.m. next Saturday for the live show. Thank you very much and enjoy your Saturday evening. Good night. <laughs>